Welcome once again to Real Sunday League Football with Revolution FC. Well, it's a home game for the team this week and we're welcoming Ripstone to Baldwin's Lane. Uh, they're chasing the title. Can the Revolution stop them? Well, here's the team looking to do it. In goal uh, will be uh, Rob Lamar, a back three today of PC, Greg and Jack. Midfield, uh, no jigger today. So we have AD, Macca, Josh, Harry and Kyle. And up top, uh, linking will be Kaiser, and then there's Callum. Your substitutes today are Cairo, Craig, and Alex. So that's the team, and you will have noticed Revolution playing in navy blue, as Ripstone are playing in red, and they don't have an away kit. So uh, Revolution bringing out their kit from three seasons ago. They're kicking off uh, from left to right in this first half. Harry on the ball. Bit of time moving it around, back inside to Josh, always moving, over to Greg, lays it out calmly to Kyle on the left-hand side, lays it inside to Kaiser, who flicks it and gives it back to Kyle, who has a shot, oh no, it was an almost a perfect start for Revolution and a good save from the Ripstone keeper. Ripstone on the attack now, their number four, lays it out to the number eight, a bit of space for him on the left-hand side. Gets around PC and then gets the cross in. It's deep towards the back post and the striker gets there. Lamar gets a hand onto it and Jack manages to clear away the danger. Josh putting the ball in towards Kaiser. Just can't keep it down. And then Harry, wild shot from him, but it falls only as far as Kyle. Harry gets it back. Inside to Callum and it's a high shot from him. Well, this is the third time uh, Revolution have played Ripstone this season. They played him in the Cup as well, uh, narrowly losing 3-2. Uh, but then beating them 3-1, one of the only, one of the few teams to beat Ripstone this season. So Revolution looking to do it again. But they've not switched on from the throw-in. And the ball played across and it's lifted and it just comes over the crossbar. Well, Revolution not switching on from that throw-in, debating that it was theirs. PC, but Rob's out. Putting the ball long, headed only as far as 80. Tries to lift it inside to Kaiser, just can't keep it down, it's bobbling up. But Callum tries to hit it on the volley, and it's just wide. And it's Callum taking the throw in, only as far as Harry. Good feet from Harry into 80, back to Harry as well. Lays the dummy and oh, the number six takes him out, but it's just on the edge of the box. Played in by Macca, headed away. Kaiser chasing that down, keeping control in the corner, lays it back towards AD, who's moved out to the left-hand side, puts the ball in high, and Greg's still in there, unable to make the header, but uh, falls to the uh, Ripstone defender, but Macker is keeping the pressure on them, and he gets the ball, and he's through on goal, sets himself up, and oh, the keeper makes a good save, pushing it onto the crossbar. Revolution could have had two at the start of this game. Ripstone could have had two at the start of this game. End to end, two good teams playing some very good football indeed. Macca plays it into Callum, plays it out first time towards AD on the right. He puts the ball over, good ball from him and Greg. His header goes over the bar and flattening the Ripstone defender as well. So a good half hour into the game. Chances at each end. And the Ripstone striker, Audius grazes the top of the bar as well. Free kick now, taken by the number eight. Lifts it in, Lamar, good save from him. Puts it out for a corner. Now another free kick, this time for Revolution. Played in by Greg. Puts it in towards the guy, has a shot. And the keeper takes that. Greg, good header from him. Under pressure from the Ripstone number eight, Josh. Heads it forward to Macker, who then heads it again. And the defender just gets his head onto it. A lot of uh, heading going on there. But then Macker calmly playing through to AD, who uh, links up with Callum very well. And the one-two with Callum and Harry. Callum putting it back in. And the keeper makes a save with that deflection from the Ripstone number six. Almost an own goal at the end of the first half. In the second half, Greg taking that free kick deep towards Macker and a glancing header just going wide 
Alex comes on for Kaiser now. 60 minutes into the game. Jackie lays out to AD. Loses the ball. And Ripstone, a chance for them now. Playing it through. A turn from the number eight. Plays it in. And Lamar just putting a foot on it and clearing the danger. It is end-to-end -end stuff. Free kick now for Revolution. Played by Greg. Put some big free kicks in already this game. And it's in. And it's Alex. He scored. Revolution taking the lead on the 63rd minute at first glance. I thought the ball had gone all the way through there from Greg. But Alex Hansen just making a touch and getting on the end of it to make it 1-0. Very dangerous ball here from Greg. Curling in towards that back post. All it needed was a slight touch from the player and that's what it got. 1-0 revolution. Ripstone. They're not going to be happy. They're going to start... Piling on the pressure now. Trying to get back into the game. The Ripstone number three. And Josh clears just before it gets to the Ripstone player. They're number two. Heading it in. But Greg's there. And he gets through. And Lamar gets down well at the feet of the number eight. Another clearance from Rob. Looking for Callum. That great combination those two have. Now Callum holding the ball up. Waiting for some help. Gets it from Macca. Doesn't take it first time, but still keeps control. But then the defender just able to clear that away. So a great game we've had here. Another couple of changes for you. Cairo coming on for Little Lady at the right wing back. And here's Cairo right now already on the attack. He just loses out at the byline. But he's chasing it back, tracking it back and gives away the free kick. Ripstone number six uh, takes that quite quickly before Revolution can get set. And it falls just beyond Greg. And the defender and the player gets there. It's the number four. And from a tight angle, equalizes. 72nd minute. Ripstone are back in the game. 1 1. Craig coming on for PC. In defense. Josh had a great game. Still attacking. As Alex trying to pile on the pressure. And there's Maka. Makes a bit of space for himself. And Callum takes the shot, slight deflection, taking most of the pressure off it. Inside the final 10 minutes of the game, here's the number four, the goal scorer for Ripstone. Takes it out wide, Craig tries to hold him up. And it plays in, it gets there to the number eight, makes the space, and Lamar gets a touch on it, and it's enough to put it wide. Revolution, lucky there, as Ripstone almost getting a late winner. The number six lays it through. And the run kept going. Plays it inside. The number four. First time shot from him. And it's creeped in the far post in the 89th minute. Devastation for Revolution. A last minute goal. It's what Ripstone needed. And Revolution. It's undeserved for them to be losing this game. They've played so well. As Kyle breaks down the left-hand side. And it goes out for a throw-in. And the referee blows the final whistle. Revolution can't get back into it. And Ripstone sneak the win. That last-minute goal for the Revolution 1. Ripstone 2. Alex with the goal at the 63rd minute. Disappointment for the Revolution team. Man of the match, as voted for by the players was Macca. Wonderful performance from him in midfield alongside Josh and Harry. Well, they picked up their performance from last week. It just wasn't to be for Revolution against Tabletop in Ripstone. Do make sure you hit the subscribe button. Join us next week. Until next time. Bang! The revolution's at hand. Never miss a moment of the action by subscribing to Revolution FC. Just tap the team badge on your screen now. Leave a comment. Let us know your thoughts on how you think the team are doing so far this season. Also find us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram at The Revolution FC.